Insignia Asset Management, a major South African investment firm with 180 BLN Rand $14.50 BLN under management, has revealed that it will launch a cryptocurrency exchange later this year. Business Tech reported May 25th. Signia CEO Magda Virzitska said the company would launch its cryptocurrency exchange, dubbed Signia Coin, in the third quarter of 2018. The cryptocurrency market is evolving at a rapid pace internationally and domestically, and is attracting both domestic and international flows. With its fintech focus, Signia is well positioned to become the first major financial services institution to embrace cryptocurrencies and to offer investors a secure trading and execution platform backed by an international infrastructure. Well-designed custody and integration with standard savings products. Virzitska placed an emphasis on security and regulatory compliance which she considers will evolve in the South African context. She noted that the South African Revenue Service SARS, has already stipulated that crypto trading is liable to tax, and that she expects further domestic crypto regulatory frameworks to follow. Meanwhile, Sinya Coin will base its policies on the existing regulatory framework currently adopted by crypto exchanges registered in New York State, namely the stringent NYBIT license, which was introduced in August of 2015. In addition to trading, Signia will create a dedicated fund that will invest in a range of cryptocurrencies on behalf of its retail and institutional clients. Signia investors will also be able to hold cryptocurrencies in their Signia accounts alongside their other assets. Just this week, South Africa's central bank, SARB, declared that cryptocurrencies are cyber tokens because they don't meet the requirements of money. The announcement followed upon SARB's establishment of a fintech task force earlier this year that will be dedicated to addressing crypto regulatory issues. In April, the central bank further established a self-regulatory organization to oversee developments in the crypto and fintech industries aimed at preventing systemic risk, although the bank stressed it was cautious not to throttle growth in the burgeoning crypto sphere. Follow us on. Thank you for listening to my channel. Please subscribe for get hot news in the world.